encounter between these two uh, besides rivals. 1-0 at the Panad Stadium last month. And Global looking for payback at home. And some uh, physical play early on. Uh, Stefan Schrock goes down on the challenge from Amani Aguinaldo. Earning a free kick for his side. And Seiko Silia, the Global striker, getting involved with some of the Ceres players early on. Free kick taken by Schrock. Just wide of uh, Patrick Data's goal. But Ceres carve out the first chance of the match. OJ Porteria forcing a fine save from Patrick Data. On the other end, it was Pika Minigishi testing Roland Muller from distance. But a major talking point here in the match as Seiko Silia goes down going after uh, Roland Muller putting pressure on the goalkeeper the goalkeeper apparently had a stuck his foot out when he made the clearance and forcing referee Clifford Daipuya to uh, see uh, a red card and also Celia giving a red card for that challenge OJ Porteria sacrificed and in comes Louis Michael Casas a native of Cebu going up against a Cebuano side and Casas called into action immediately but Ceres given some chances here and Stefan Schrock just denied by the by the post here Patrick Data was beaten already but he was rescued by the post a lot of talk was centered on uh, the condition of the pitch with Sarah's co uh, coach Risto Vidakovic complaining saying that the pitch was too dangerous for players but it was Ceres who was dictating the play that time Ian Ramsey Denied by Patrick Dato. Dennis Villanueva trying uh, from distance. And coming off a hat trick last week. But Rodriguez fails to find the target that time. On the other end, it was Amani Aguinaldo with the chance. He sends his header over the bar. Another chance here for Globo. And they finally take the lead in the 43rd minute. Matthew Hartman with a curling effort. Sending the Cebu faithful into delirium. 5,350 fans in attendance to see their home side taking the lead. Thanks to this curling strike from Matthew Hartman. And look how much it means to Global Cebu. But Serra is not done yet in the first half. As uh, Patrick Dato had to snuff out at the Cebu City Sports Center. Global with a free kick here. And Wesley Dos Santos gets in the end of that one. Off target. For the global defender. On the other end, a corner is cleared away. Christians puts it back in a dangerous position. This is Maranyon. And then keeps it in play. And it's taken away by Global. Once again, Bienvenido Maranyon. Struggling with the conditions of the pitch. And it forces. A diving save from Dato. Dato doing well there to keep the clean sheet. Maranyon always dangerous. Picking up that ball at midfield. Testing Dato from distance. And that's how it finished. 
at the Cebu City Sports Center, Global Cebu, coming away with a 1-0 win over fierce rival Ceres Negros.